version of Beauty and the Beast starring Emma Watson as Belle. I'm so excited, guys. So behind me here, I have a few of my favorite Beauty and the Beast memorabilia. And I'm also, later in the video, going to be doing a movie review because Mom, Grammy, and I went and saw Beauty and the Beast. So I'm so excited, and I hope you guys are going to go see it. Let me know in the comment below if you're going to. But right now, let me show you what we got here. Huh? So, of course, we had to go to Build-A-Bear, guys, and pick up this. This is The Beast from Build-A-Bear, and he's so fluffy and nice. And we have Belle's Rose there, and see, there's the tag. And look at his feet, guys. It says Beauty and the Beast. And then it says Beast on his other foot. So we got him. We also got these guys. I love the pops. They're so cool. And uh, yes, yeah, so the Beast is kind of furry. We got these at Hot Topic because they have a lot of Beauty and the Beast stuff right now. And yeah, I love them so much. They're so cute. And then we have this necklace that we've actually had for a while that is the Bell's Rose inside the glass case. And it's a necklace on that gold chain there. And then the newest item that I have as well is this Beauty and the Beast journal. It is so cool. Flip it over, Mom, for me. Yes, guys, check that out. Isn't that cool? So yeah, it's very neat. It has this little tassel right here so you can mark your pages. And it has these little latches here that you can open. And you can open it up and look who it is, guys. Yes, I love it. And then you open it up and here are the pages with all the different characters and things. So that way you can journal and write in it. So we haven't written anything in it yet. But then here is the bookmark here, which is the string. And we love it. We love it so much. And then you just latch it shut. Now, it doesn't lock, but that's okay because we still like it. And on the back is where you'll see it says Beauty and the Beast. So anyway, guys, yes, that is my mini Disney Beauty and the Beast haul because these are my favorite pieces. We also own the cartoon, of course. And yeah, so let me show you what we got uh, for the movie and um, the review of mine that I'm going to do. I just want to say a big thank you to Emma Watson for bringing my favorite Disney princess to life and doing it so beautifully. Thank All you. right, guys. So this is what we got from the movie theater. There was, at our local theater, a special fan event. And it was a little more expensive than the regular movie, but that was okay because it's worth it because Beauty and the Beast is my favorite and it's mom's favorite too. So anyway, we decided to go to this fan event, which was at 6 p.m. on Thursday, March 16th. So it came out the uh, night before the movie officially was released on the 17th. And it included some freebies. And we also got to see it in one of those IMAX theaters with the really, really, really big screen and the surround sound and all that. And it was in 3D. So anyway, guys, here we go. So part of the event, they give you a free popcorn tub and cup. So mom, can you hold them up for me? Mm -hmm. So here is the cup that was free. So it says Beauty and the Beast in theaters March 17th and it was at a Cinemark theaters where we saw our movie and yeah so it's just a nice cup came with a lid and then this was full of popcorn which of course we ate and yeah so same as the cup Beauty and the Beast all that jazz very nice little tub now while we were at the concession stand getting our free popcorn tub and souvenir cup we saw uh, these guys. All right, Mom, show them what we got. So these we had to pay for. They were not included in our tickets. But while we like those, we feel that these are absolutely more fabulous. So anyway, here is a big cup. So it's got the rose on one side and Beauty and the Beast on the other. So yeah, nice collectible cup. And these are limited edition, so there was only a certain amount of them at the theater. So here is the popcorn tub, guys. This is the most beautiful popcorn tub we have ever seen. Look at this, guys. So it's got two sides with the picture and two sides where it says Beauty and the Beast. And yeah, so let's just look at this really detailed up close. Look at it, guys. 
the most gorgeous popcorn tub we have ever seen. Oh my goodness. So yeah, we had to buy those separately. So now we have four, <laughs> four things. And another thing that we got for free though, this was part of the package we bought, is this Beauty and the Beast, uh, this 3D cube thing. It's an Enchanted Rose craftable paper figure. So it's a little weird and yeah, flip it over mom, it looks extremely complicated. So we may or may not make this thing. If we have the time, you gotta glue it. And it's a whole process. So anyway, but we have this uh, Enchanted Rose uh, 3D cube thing. So yeah, so that is our haul, you guys. It is just gorgeous. So anyway, we were very happy with all of that. And speaking of being happy, you guys, if you have not seen this movie yet, please go see it whenever you can and if you can. It is a fabulous movie. They took the cartoon that came out a long time ago and they enhanced it, which means they made it even better. So there's more songs included, there's more scenes included that weren't in the original cartoon, and it was fabulous, guys. I'm not going to give away any spoilers or anything because a lot of you know how the movie ends anyway, but I will talk about the acting and things of that nature. So, Emma Watson, fabulous. Best Belle ever. She can sing, she can dance, she acted very well. And Dan Stephen, who plays the Beast, he did a wonderful job too. The entire cast was perfectly cast, wonderful talent, and it was just such a good time. The visuals were stunning, you guys. Visuals, stunning, on point, beautiful. It should be nominated for an Oscar for special effects. It was gorgeous. Just a visually stunning movie. Very pretty, very well done, very acted. The plot was nice, the pace was nice. And any of the critics out there that are complaining about this movie, I don't know what you be talking about. It was fabulous, you guys. We want to go see it again. So anyway, let me know your thoughts on the movie. If you went and saw it, leave me a comment below and let me know if you want to see it, if you've seen it, and if you have, what you thought of it. So anyway, guys, yeah, I would love to hear your thoughts. Leave me a comment below. Be sure to subscribe. There'll be more videos coming. I'm trying to get back on track with my video making. And also follow me on all my social media. Those links are in the description box below. And I will see you guys later. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.